Hello friends, welcome to our page InstaRev. In this video, we will be telling you how to crack gate in 60 days. In this video, we will be discussing the tips, tricks as well as planning strategy which will help you to secure good rank. To know more, keep on watching. Firstly, you need to know about gate exam pattern. As you know, gate is a computer based test of 3 hour duration. It consists of 65 questions of maximum marks 100. There are 30 questions of 1 marks each and 35 questions of 2 marks each. In 1 marks there are 1 third negative marking that is 0.33. In 2 marks there are 2 third negative marking that is 1.33. There are 2 types of questions asked in gate that is MCQ and numerical answer type question. For numerical answer type question there is no negative marking. So feel free to attempt. Secondly, I would like you to know about GATE syllabus. So to do this, take a printout of entire GATE syllabus from GATE official website and paste it in your study room. It may be near your study table or any place where you can clearly see it. And now after pasting that, highlight all the topic which you completed. It will help you to analyze that which topic is completed and what are the topic which are left. So you can clearly divide the time for revision as well as completion over left topic. So this will help you to get a perfect evaluation of your study progress so that you can boost yourself to complete more topic and give more time to revision. And so you can have perfect division of time between revision and completion of topic. Take a calendar or take my advice, make a calendar and mark all the day left for exam. In other words, start a countdown for exam. After knowing about gate exam pattern syllabus, third point is analyze syllabus. Gate syllabus consists of three parts. First aptitude, second engineering mathematics, third technical subject. In aptitude, there are 10 questions asked of weight as 15 marks. Aptitude consists of two sections, numerical ability and verbal ability. Numerical ability has two sections, that is quantitative aptitude and reasoning. It has weightage of 7 to 8 marks and verbal ability has weightage of 6 to 7 marks. In engineering mathematics, there are 6 to 7 questions asked of weight is 13 to 15 marks. Basically, aptitude and engineering mathematics are two most important subjects and it determines your rank. Cracking gate is easy, but cracking rank is tough. If you want to get good rank and want to get uh, into PSU or IIT, you have to study in aptitude and engineering mathematics in a very smart way. In technical subject, it contains subject of your branch, whether it is mechanical, Computer Science, Electrical, Electronics. As I said, Engineering Mathematics is very important subject. So in this, I will be telling you about strategy and tips for mathematics. I will recommend book Gate Engineering Mathematics by May Dizzy. The key feature of this book is that in this book, question is arranged in topic wise and chapter wise. And also it contain question from all branch. So it will be very useful for gate aspirant. Always aim to increase speed with accuracy. Always solve gate last year question and try to uh, measure your speed. So check your accuracy and then analyze yourself. Only this subject having highest mark that is 15 marks and it is easy to score. Study daily at least 2 to 3 hours and always while studying make notes for every topic which will cover all important point and formula. It will help you to do revision in last time. So now we will discuss tips and strategy for aptitude. The first very important book for quantitative aptitude is R.S. Agrawal. Go through previous year paper. You will get an idea. After getting idea, pick this R.S. Agrawal book and start solving the problem. Do as many problem as you can. For verbal section, study Brennan Martin book and solve last year question. For vocabulary, you can refer to word power made easy by Norman Lewis. It will help you to increase your vocabulary. Also, you can refer to GRE 350 high frequency word, which will help you in solving antonyms, synonym, etc. type problem. Vocabulary will not be prepared in one day, so practice vocabulary on daily basis. Increase your speed in calculation and study basic concept. Keep in mind, don't leave general aptitude and mathematics for last. Please practice sample paper and previous year paper. You can also join online test series and solve mock test for regular basis. For technical subject, choose any five subject in which you are good and study them well. Instead of studying all subjects, just study five subjects which have higher weightage and rest of study average. Know the weightage of each subject accordingly. You should plan and do study 
Complete one subject in five day maximum. After completing subject, evaluate yourself by practicing previous year gate question. You can also go to website www.gatetestseries.in, which contain last 25 year of IES gate question topic wise arranged and fully solved in quiz manner. Solve each quiz and see solution of each question. After completing test, it will clear your concept and boost your confidence. While preparing each subject, prepare notes for last minute revision. Now I will tell you about branch wise important subject. The important subject of computer science and information technology are programming and data structure, theory of computation, operating system, digital logic and computer networks. While in electronics and communication engineering, important subject are networks, signal and system, control system, digital electronics, electromagnetics, EDC, analog circuit and communication. In electrical engineering, network theory, control system, power system, electrical machine, power electronics and signal and system. While in mechanical engineering, important subject are manufacturing science, industrial engineering, thermal science, fluid machine and strength of material. These important subject contribute up to 50 marks in gate examination. So rather studying all subject, you must go through this important subject thoroughly. And if you study this along with aptitude engineering mathematics, you can easily score 50 plus. If you want to achieve rank under 500 or if you want to go to PSU, you need to study smart. This time you need to know about most important topic as well as least important topic. Now we will be discussing about the study plan. For the first 10 days, you should cover mathematics and aptitude. As I said, verbal ability portion need to practice daily. So study verbal ability on regular basis. Mathematics, numerical ability need to cover in first 10 day after completing do revision after certain interval so that you don't forget what you read. Next from technical subject, you should select 5 subjects having high weightage like in mechanical, manufacturing science, industrial, thermal science, strength of material, theory of machine accounts up to 50 marks. Rest of subject study average but please focus on subject having high weightage. Saw so last year gate IS problem. Prepare notes, also make a proper plan for revision. You start with one subject, complete it and then start second. Mark the difficult topics and important topics and give more time to it. In next 30 days, you should cover technical subject. In last 20 days, you should solve mock tests either daily or one in two days or join all India test series. This time you should not study any new topic. Practice as much you can. Start with subject wise mock test then move to full syllabus test. Solve minimum 10 full length mock test. Try to improve your numerical solving ability with accuracy using virtual calculator. You need to practice gate online virtual calculator. This is very very important. And last minute strategy. Before 1-2 days keep your mind calm, relax. Don't take tension, just revise the formulas and important points, take a proper sleep before examination, before exam day, you know your center and be ready for admit card, everything will be good. Best of luck. Thanks for watching our video. For more such update and exam tips, do subscribe to our channel. So keep sharing and all the best. Thank you.